What a way to roll into the travel show. Everyone is loving scooters right now. And this oversized version proves that you don't need four wheels when two fat tires gives you stability like this. The Scruiser is an electric powered scooter with a top speed of 25 kilometers or 15 miles per hour. You've got two options to get things going. Either use the thumb throttle switch or you can kick off with your foot manually and then the battery charge motor will take over. It takes two and a half hours to fully power the battery and the makers claim that one charge will last 55 kilometers or 34 miles. Okay, so it's not as nimble as some of the other electric scooters that we've reviewed in the past, but that's because of the size of it. But what comes with that is a very easy ride. I mean, I could stick my mum on this and she'll master it in no time. What you're seeing right here though is a prototype. The makers are actually working on a more road-friendly version, which will have headlights and some other additional features. But the rules about using these vary incredibly from country to country. So before you shell out all this money, make sure you do your research. What's the point in gadgets and technology? Well, they're there to help you get more out of life. And with this, you get more out of your suitcase. The Go Bag is a carry-on sized travel bag designed to give you as much space as possible by vacuum packing your luggage. In terms of just a basic case, this is lovely. It's even got this convenient little clear pouch for your toiletries, nice. But in terms of the time it takes for you to load up the yellow bag, squeeze all the air out manually, then get the vacuum cleaner to suck the extra air out, you're better off just taking your time and folding your clothes properly to maximize the space in there, which is what I'm gonna do now. One for all you lazy lads out there, you know who you are. You're on a night out, but you don't wanna iron your whole shirt because no one's gonna see it. You might be wearing a jacket or a jumper over the top. Right, so what can people see? Well, they can see this area here and your collars. Well, now they've brought out an iron just for this. The Collar Perfect is designed for quick touch-ups and for smoothing out wrinkles without having to get out an ironing board. You obviously have to be a little bit careful when you're opening it up because your fingers and thumbs will be right near the hot plates there. And this way you can use it for like a larger surface area as well. I thought this was going to be a bit gimmicky just for your collars and stuff like that, but it works. It's practical. And for a weekend away, you've effectively got a flat pack iron. Oh, a lovely picture of a statue in the park. Boring! Here's a camera that's meant for much more extreme situations. You could be on the beach, on the slopes, or even in water. Look at it, it's fearless. Rah! <laughs> it doesn't even flinch. The new 16 megapixel camera from Nikon is waterproof to a depth of 30 meters, shockproof when dropped from heights of up to two meters, and cold resistant to minus 10 degrees Celsius. You can also film HD videos with it. Okay, so it hasn't got the functions of a DSLR camera, but then you haven't got the bulk either. And as the gap between a good smartphone camera and a point and shoot one like this closes, you have gotta ask yourself, why would you want this? It's the durability, and there's only one way to test that. Can't do that with your mobile phone. Smile. How do you delete? 